Come on. This is not millions of dollars we're dealing with. I'm a musician, so $30,000 is a lot for me. But for other people, they're like, oh, I can make that in a week. So any money is good for me at this point in time. So does principal playing heavier now at this point in the game? You can't have zero scruples. That's all. Never in my life have I considered myself to be the normal, average person until put into this situation. Paul flies off the handle at the drop of a hat. I'll step out of the van. You need me to step out of the van? Mark is paranoid. I don't trust myself. I don't trust myself. And Nicole is a psychopath. I'm going to kill you while you sleep. I can do it and not leave any forensic evidence. Now I'm surrounded by insane people. These people are crazy. How tough has it been not reaching the outside world? It's miserable. It's absolutely miserable. My wife and I haven't gone one day without speaking to each other in almost 19 years. And now it's been 23 days. It's been hell. Being away from home has changed me drastically. It's difficult just having nobody to go to when you're at your lowest point. Who else is having a hard time with not reaching out and touching anybody? It's killing me. That, that's for damn sure. Uh, I mean, I've resorted to talking to a damn lemon. Oh my God, still there. <laughs> Who is dying, and I refuse I to get rid of him. <laughs> I refuse to get rid of him. I love you, lemon. It's going bad. <laughs> it's going bad. Are others having a tough time not talking? No. What about you, Claire? You know, I don't think about it that much. I think about the game. I brought photos from home. You know, every night I look at my wife, look at my children, and I know they're there waiting for me. It is absolutely part of my strategy to be more quiet and mysterious. I think it's just been magnified here, and I'm sitting back and using it more, perhaps to manipulate or just to hide my true intentions. Let's raise our glasses and give a toast to the next victim of the mole. Yep. Adios. Adios. Bon voyage, guys. Tonight's execution is a little tenuous. We've got one person with an exemption, you know, so now I've got a one out of six chance of saying. Get ready, America. The quiz is coming up next. Time now for the quiz. 10 questions about the mole. The player who scores the lowest will be executed and must leave the game immediately. Question number one, is the mole male or female? Question number two, in the all for one mission, from my perspective, where was the mole chained left to right? The mole could be Mark. I think he's playing this game too hard. You've been telling me all along it's all about the hustle. This is not a hustle. A, this is not a hustle. I don't know that, Paul. The mole needs to have some sort of facade, and that could be his. Question number three. In all for one, when did the mole grab the key? I've been gunning for one person the whole time as the mole, knowing that many of the guys are just playing the odds. I even know Nicole's playing the odds. It just puts me at an advantage. Question number four. Did the mole get inside of a sleeping bag during the all for one mission? Question number five. During the traveler's mission, what was the mole wearing? We made it! Question number six. In Travelers, what form of transportation was originally assigned to the mole? I'm not gonna make it easy for you guys. Craig has been on the top of my list since day one, and as people drop off, it just confirms some of my suspicions. Question number seven. Who was the mole paired with for the Traveler's mission? I feel nervous going into tonight's execution because to me, this is the turning point in the game. I am either going to play odds or I'm going to target one person completely, and it could end my game. Question number eight. At breakfast before the Traveler's mission, where was the mole sitting clockwise from me? Question number nine. Has the mole had an exemption to date? Nicole, she's a wild card. At times she's annoying, at times she's helpful, at times you see a glimmer of truth, at times you say this woman is lying about everything. I would like to have a computer where I can verify her name is Nicole, because I don't even know if that's right. Question number 10. Who is the mole? Good evening, players. This is the old Mendoza train station, site of your fifth execution. The pot stands at $177,000.
For tonight's execution, Craig has an exemption. That means he is safe. Unfortunately for the other six players, it also means one of you will be going home tonight. And once again, we have a tie. The player with the slowest time on the quiz will be executed. The difference in time, one second. Wow. I will access your quiz results one at a time. If the screen turns green, you're safe. If, however, the screen turns red, you've been executed. Is everybody ready? Yeah. Alex. Paul, are you ready for your quiz results? Let's go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Woo, boy. <laughs> Kristen. Oh. Kristen, I'm sorry. Please come with me. I'm disappointed, but I guess my strategy in taking the quiz was to focus on one person. So if it wasn't this week, it probably would have been next. It's completely ironic that I'm the only woman here in a group of men because I'm a gynecologist and all I work with all day is women. I will miss Kristen greatly. She was highly intelligent. I thought she had it and I'm floored. I feel lucky to have made it this far. I mean, cause on some level, it really is just chance. I'm a gambler, I take risks and you know, it caught up with me. Bye. Bye. Air transportation provided by Lawn Airlines.